This is a... First video I've done for my X Trails extra trail. I'm gonna. This is just gonna be a pretty random trail channel. I'm gonna do uh, and, uh, just bits that I'm gonna enjoy doing. Magnet fishing, for example, all sorts of things. And this is my first magnet finish, magnet fishing magnet that I've bought. Open the box. Yay! It says it feels pretty light, but hey, come on. Put my magnets in there, brilliant. And my stuff package, as usual, for Amazon. And my new SD card. So now I can be able, now I will be able to do longer videos, it says, hopefully. And also for my magnet, I've got some of this thread locker. I don't know, it just, seem, just seems common sense to put a thread locker on it because you don't want to lose your magnet when you've spent all that money on it. So I'm going to give it a go. See what happens. I also get free road weight, which is good. And for 19.99 from Amazon, it was uh, worth an invest. Just to see. Something to see if I'll enjoy. If I don't, then that'll be it. Pretty thin. It's not stretchy. I expected the road to be a bit stretchy, but it's not, as you can see. There you go. Hopefully, this video won't take longer than 10 minutes because 10 minutes is all I've got on this SD card. Don't know how long the battery's going to last, but there you go. Well, that magnet's not quite what I expected. It's a little bit small. It's a very small. But then again, it's only about, I don't know, 150 kg picking power. First thing I'm going to do is put some Loctite on. It seems common sense to use thread locker because, as I say, you don't want to lose your memory. Now to open the thread locker. Whoop. Sign for the thread locker www.vita something.com. I can't read it, but I'll put a link down to it in the, in the website. And that was from my local, quite from my local, um, my local hardware store. Didn't know how to do this thread locker, but we'll have to have a look. So I'll just put it on the threads, or do I put it in the hole, or do I put it over there? Oh! Perhaps I put it everywhere. <laughs> Shit! Oh well, never mind. This is going to go really messy.
scripts to go off. Ooh, it smells a bit weird. I'm not a glue sniffer, I just want you to know what it's not like. And after we put it on outside, that's how it seems common sense to use said locker. I don't want to lose um, I don't want to lose my magnet under any circumstances where I don't know, don't be a cheap one, but you never know. kitchen roll just to wipe the mess up. Later on, when I get my new SD card, I'll be doing a video on my first ever magnet fishing trip. And we'll see how that goes. I bet you can see my shoe pile under my fire, can't you? I like to keep my shoes warm. There you go. You go. I think it's nine meters of free rope with as well. So for the price of 19.99 from Amazon.co.uk. I didn't think it was up. Right. We'll see. And now to unbox my new my new SD card. Hopefully it'll be compatible with the, with the camera that I've got. One never knows. Here you go, Ultima. No, ten ten ninety nine, I think it was from Amazon. So just 10.99, cheap. Some good reviews on it as well, so I wouldn't have bothered with it. But it's as good as they say. The the other ones, the popular makes scan. I can't remember the name of it, but you know what I mean. In any case, the super duper scan cards that are really expensive. I say it's just as good as them. A bit more slower. I don't know. Upload and download speed, but hey, who cares as long as it films in HD, and as long as it works in my camera. Thanks for watching.